Hi, I'm Steve Graff with Deer Valley Mountain Biking, and we're here today for a progress report on Tidal Wave, our newest flow trail. We've gotten a couple more sections done since Park City TV's last visit, so I'd like to take you up and show you what we've done and show you what we got coming. So let's go. Hope I didn't run over his foot. So Tidal Wave, phase one, we used the Road to Ruby alignment and it comes down here to where we are at the beginning of phase two. And phase two, the jump section, runs right along top of Homeward Bound. We have a lot of tabletops and step-ups, um, jumps they call shark fins all through here. And then beginning right about here is phase three, and that's when we get right back into berms again. Um, and, and phase two and three have jumps and Berms. So phase three is a combination of one and two and it comes through this section and we're currently built to this intersection right here and we are now working on phase four which comes down Ontario Canyon and in a couple weeks time we'll be finished all the way to the bottom of Sterling. A lot of jumps. We have step ups and step downs and tabletops. I believe there are 12 to 16 jumps in phase two. Uh, that you can see them behind me. Uh, it takes a huge amount of effort to get these done. We've had two excavators working, uh, half a dozen hand crew, you know, seven days a week, 10 hours a day. Uh, each jump takes those machines at least three, four days a piece to build, um, and then the turns take a huge amount of effort as well. Super well received, people are really stoked to be riding Tidal Wave, and we're glad to get more and more of it done. further down in phase two and the jumps are continuing into the aspens and it's just one after another. Um, they're so well designed that expert riders, you know, they can jump on the takeoff, land really smooth in the landing. If you're just starting out, you can just roll over them and not ever have your tires leave the ground. If you're starting to progress a little bit, you can catch air and not make it to the end and land on the top and uh, everybody has fun. It's a real wide appeal, uh, especially this phase two. So now here we are at the start of phase three, our latest section of Tidal Wave. And like I said before, phase one is all about the berms, phase two, was all about the jumps and phase three is a combination of berms and jumps. So we start off with a step down and then we go into a couple really big smooth berms and then a couple more jumps and then a couple more berms and uh, the fun continues on Tidal Wave with phase three. So that's the progress report on our newest trail, Tidal Wave. Uh, as you can see, it's a lot of fun. It's been really well received. People are loving to ride it. Um, we've had an incredibly busy summer here at Deer Valley. Uh, not only Tidal Wave, but we rebuilt half of Nail Driver, one of our existing trails, loaded it with berms, made it flow better. Um, opening very soon, within the next couple days, is Twist and Shout, which is another uh, rebuild that we were doing. Uh, it's going to 
at least double the length, the twist and shout. We've added some black level berm speed and flow to that trail. Um, so lots of exciting stuff happening. As you can see behind me, we're doing some construction on phase four of Tidal Wave. Should be open within the next couple of weeks and we'll keep on building. You keep on riding, go to DeerValley.com for more information.